Hey Pokemon fans and welcome to the fourth episode of my Pokemon Black Randomized Nuzlocke Challenge. And in this episode we will take on the gym leader and try to catch a new Pokemon. But first we're going to go over here and beat Sharon or Sharon. Comment down below if it's Sharon or Sharon because this is bugging me because I don't know who what to call him. Because, yeah. Yes, of course, I'm going to try to defeat the gym leader. And, uh, also, I am going to change the rules a little bit of my Let's Play. Basically, comment down below after I get six Pokemon, or more than six Pokemon, on which Pokemon I should carry in my party. Basically, uh, you know, let y'all viewers decide on what would be the best team for me because that would make it a little bit more interesting and my Mr. Al is going to take that water gun like a boss and also uh, I apologize for the low sound quality and me talking very low uh, you know lowly speaking and stuff like that basically I was recording them episodes at like 2 and 3 o'clock in the morning even 7 o'clock in the morning I'm not too sure uh, it was last night, and I was very, very sleepy. I do apologize. It is now 7 o'clock at night, so I am wide awake and drinking energy drinks. Yay for energy drinks. And his Osiroth goes down, and he's going to send out his Purloin. Purloin. Like I said before, I'm sorry if I butchered the name. And, yeah. Since he's going to send out his poor Lauren, since it's a dark type, I am going to send out my bastard to go, you know, tackle him to death. I'm actually really glad I got this clay doll because the clay doll is actually proven to be quite useful with the confusion and stuff. And I'm actually starting to like him more and more each time I use him. Because this bastard won't freaking do any damage because his attack is so low but his defense is so good though I really really do wish I I had some better Pokemon right now but I won't be able to catch any new friends until after the gym leader which really kinda sucks seeing as how uh, I picked the uh, Pokemon that was in the fireplace and it was a rock type so the first gym leader I'm going to face is going to be a water type. So basically right now I'm just healing up my Pokemon and then I'm going to go and uh, defeat some people in the dream yard and try to get me a new friend over here. And first I'm going to talk to him, let him go inside and do his own little thing. Excuse me now, blah blah blah, who gives a shit about you? I'll beat you here in a minute. So I'm going to go over here to the dream yard and battle her and I swear too many people has freaking pearly ones in the beginning of this game I mean it's just not fair it's not fair and these are like a wall to my freaking Pokemon so I'm gonna send that bastard fuck him up bastard and, um, I'd like to give a, well, no, no, that's the leaf green comment, so I'm just going to wait until I do the leaf green. I actually, I actually uh, got the re leaf green recorded. I just have to do the audio with it. I sit there and I recorded the audio to it, but uh, I forgot to hit start recording. So I was basically talking to myself the whole time. So I don't really feel like, you know, there doing a commentary on that yet plus a lot of people has been watching my Pokemon Black I have more views in the three Pokemon Black videos than all ten of my uh, Leaf Green Nuzlocke randomized challenge so like I said he's just gonna basically wall me and I'm gonna wall him cause he ain't doing he's doing absolutely nothing to my bastard and finally I, I kill him and he's gonna send out another one. I'm like, no. Why 
why do you have to do this to me? Why? Why Arceus? And basically I'm just gonna sit here and ta tackle him and stuff and uh... I, I apologize for uh, spamming all the Pokemon fan pages on Facebook. I can't comment on YouTube videos because of stupid Google Plus. I mean, that is just really, really freaking stupid. And like I said, I only got a phone internet and I can't, you know, change it or whatever. So that really sucks. So basically, if you comment on my video, ask me a question, I will try my hardest to answer it during uh, the videos that I'm uploading like right now I'm going on my YouTube channel on my phone and seeing if y'all commented yet on my Pokemon Black and I'd like to say uh, someone disliked the first video and I think it's because I said not uh, no one has did a black randomized Nuzlocke challenge and yeah <laughs> Okay, I have no comments yet, but I do have 18 views as of right now on my part one, and that was uploaded last night, so, or this early, early, early this morning, so yeah. Kind of, I'm st still wishing I had that Metagross, I caught him, because it would help a lot on this gym leader. So basically, if, uh... I'll, I'll tell you a little bit later on because I don't want to spoil it. I don't like spoilers. And this video is 20 minutes long, but it is like one gig long. One gigabyte. That is a thousand megabytes. To put it in perspective, a usual song is about three to six megabytes long. In the God of the Vita, which is like a, a very, very long song, it's only like 17 megabytes, I think. I'm not too sure on that one. So yeah. Mr. Al's going to gain up to level 10 finally. And I'm trying to get him high enough that way he can withstand a couple water attacks. And uh, I know this Patrax or Patrat or Patrat. Comment down below still if it's uh, Patrat or Patrat because I really don't know. It looks like Patrat. But it might be Patrat. And then, uh, Youngster Joey. Oh, that is Youngster Joey. Where's your red attack? Is this your top percentage Lillipup? I think, uh, young, Youngster Joey's red attack is, uh, you got all 31 IVs and, uh, EV trains very, very well. Because how can you have a, uh, you know, top percentage of red attack? And, uh, Basically, he's going to give me a Pokemon. He's like, Bastion. It does not do well against water types. Do you want this R Regiace of mine? I'm like, um, yeah. <laughs> I would love a uh, Regiace. <laughs> but, uh, um, unfortunately, I cannot keep him because he is a legendary. And I can't have a legendary during my Nuzlocke challenge. I'm just going to name him throw away and throw him away as soon as I get to the Pokemon box. So yeah. And actually that that Reg Ice would actually uh, help me out a lot during the gym leader. But I can't. I'm actually looking for any type of grass that way I can catch a new friend because this is going to be really hard to defeat this gym leader with only uh, Bastard and Mr. Owl, so, yeah. So, I'm just going to uh, move my Pokemon around, get this Reggie Ice. I'm, I'm just looking at his stats and stuff and crying a little bit on the inside because, you know, Icy Wind is a good mood move and I should have just... Uh, went back and uh, used explosion and killed them all like a true camp champ and then released them but he's a legendary so I don't want to use legendaries because then if I did get a legendary I'd just basically walk through the game 
and that would not be fair. And it is raining outside. Rain, rain, go away. I'm trying to play my Pokemon. He's gonna give me a fresh water, which that will help out a lot, but of course, you know, a potion will do too. So basically, if you don't know this gym puzzle, it's basically uh, whatever's on the curtain, you have to uh, step on the tile that is weak against. Like uh, for that fire type, I stepped on the water, so. It took me a little bit to figure that out the first time I played. Because I did not notice that uh, it had a fire thing on the first one. He's going to send out his little papa, and I'm going to send out my Mr. Owl. Comment down below of how many licks do you think it takes to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop. And don't say three, <laughs> like the commercial said way back in the day. I also have my uh, microphone steady right now, and he's going to learn Mud Slap, and I almost got rid of Teleport. And I would have been so mad if I would have. Because teleport has helped me out a little bit of getting back to the Pokemon Center a lot faster because it is very laggish whenever I am uh, playing this. And yeah, I can't fast forward it while I'm playing it. So I'm going to defeat this other waiter, which I don't know why waiters are in this thing. And I don't know why she speaks freaking. I think that's French that she speaks. I'm not too sure on that. She's gonna use her Patrat or Pat Rat. Don't forget to comment down below on which one it is. Let me change. Let me move my monitor over a little bit. And he's gonna use Bind, and I'm like, oh my god, it's going to kill my clay doll because if I don't kill him in two moves, which of course I get the confusion, and I'm like, yes. I just hope he don't. Of course, now I know I got him in the bag because he's less than half. So I, I killed this Patrat or Pat Rat, or her Pat Rat or Patrat. So I'll send out her Purloin, and uh, I will just stay in because he needs the experience. And I meant to hit Mud Slap. I, I know it's Dark Type, and I know Psychic Types cannot do nothing against Dark Type unless you have a uh, Miracle Eye or something like that. Or whatever it's called basically it can't do nothing to my mr. Allen anyway so I'm just gonna must slap it and you know lower down its accuracy anyways that's actually what I should uh, I bet it was a surprise for y'all BAM mud slap you right in the face I hope y'all are enjoying this uh, Nuzlocke run, and it's actually uh, it's actually kind of fun for me to do it. And uh, don't forget to uh, after I get six Pokemon to comment on which ones I should have on my team and stuff, because you know that'd be kind of cool. Basically, now I am to the gym leader, and I would go ahead and face him, but. I'm going to go ahead and heal up my Pokemon because I know this dude is going to freaking use water. And uh, I think uh, Bastard is still type, so actually Bastard is weak against all three of them. <laughs> so uh, I really screwed the pooch on this one, on this Nuzlocke. I should have thought ahead while choosing my starters, but yeah. I can't help it now. I can't go back and change my starter. He is my friend, and I will not get rid of him unless he dies. Which, of course, he's only level 8 right now. And I'm going to rely on confusion to the gym leader battle. <laughs> so, yeah. Finally, I am to the first gym. This is only episode 4. <laughs> Oh, it's already episode 4, and I'm just now facing freaking Crest, the gym leader. I, I like 
is music. I also like whenever you get them down to the last Pokemon, the uh, music changes and stuff. So I'm not really too scared of this little pup. He is going to sit there and work up and try to set up on me a little bit, but I'm not scared of him at all. Or that is a... Is that a female little pup or is that a male little pup? Yeah, that's a male little pup. So yeah. And it's going to use his potion, which I am glad that he did not save that potion for freaking, uh, what should we call it? Uh, I'm, I'm kind of scared of this, uh, Pampor. I'm really scared of it because it has water gun and work up. So, basically... I'm just going to confuse him and it does nothing because he is two levels higher than me and that did like a lot. And I did not notice I was this low of health and I'm glad that he used a work up. I'm very glad that he used it that way my he did not die. So basically I'm just going to use a potion on him. Kill him back up to full health. Or close to full health. 34, no. He's going to try to set up some more with a workup. I'm like, oh my god, he's fixing to sweep me. He is fixing to sweep all my Pokemon. And I am going to fail this Nuzlocke right now. But I get him down a lot. And... Yeah. So basically, he's doing more than half right now. If I change the Bastard, he might die. I'm actually really worried about that. So I'm gonna try to push him up and hopefully uh, he does like not that much at all. And yeah, it does this. I'm sitting there thinking I'm faster than him. So, and I don't kill him. He uses water gun and no, no. Why Arceus, why? Mr. Al is now dead, and I can no longer use him. It's my first death in this Nuzlocke, and now all I got is one Pokemon, and he might die. Please don't die. And he survives it, just a little, and I take him down. Fuck you, Pampor. Fuck you, Chris. You killed my Mr. Al. You killed him. You bastard. No, I'm not talking about you, Bastion. I'm like, no, I don't want the gym badge. I want Mr. Owl back. He was a good Pokemon. I guess that's what I get for bad-mouthing him. So I finally get my first badge. <laughs> and he's going to give me work up, which I really don't give a shit about. And... So basically, I'm just going to go and uh, try to catch my new friend, but I realize how much time I've got. I ain't got that much time, so basically, he's going to take me to his house. And basically, you know, we'll get on with the storyline a little bit. Blah, blah, this, blah, blah, that. I don't care what you say. I'll help you get your dream, miss. BS. <laughs> You'll give me cut. Which, uh, I don't have anyone that can learn cut. So I might have to go back and catch a Pokemon that can learn cut. Just as an HM slave. I cannot use them in battle. I can only use them for cut. Because I can't progress through the game without cut. So, right now I am going to put Mr. Al into right now I'm checking to see just for the shits and the giggles if Mr. Al can learn cut which he can't so he is completely useless to me now because he is dead and I can no longer use him so I'm basically just going to deposit him into uh, basically my death pit and I'm going to name my box the death pit and make it look a little bit more like hell so yeah 
change the wallpaper and scenery too and the volcano. I always do that. And I'm gonna name it I'm gonna name it Death Pit. And I'm gonna name Box One Friends uh, as soon as I get some more friends. Or some more Pokemon. Or whatever, so. Like I said, they are our friends and we like our friends, so. Unless they die, then they go to the Death Pit of Doom. Well, uh, this wraps up for this video. Like if you like, comment if you like, subscribe if you like, and as always, thank you for watching. Uh, comment question of the day is, what is your favorite Gen 5 starter?